Let's test the new Raspberry Pi Imager. We start by selecting the device, operating system, and storage. For that, we insert a micro SD card into our reader. Once it's detected, we move on. The next steps guide us through customization and host configuration. Wi-Fi setup, SSH access, and new in this version. The integration of Raspberry Pi Connect, which lets us access our Pi remotely from the very first boot. Once everything is configured, the system is flashed as usual. What do you think about the new, clean design and the easy step-by-step -step workflow? The verification and installation complete, and we're shown a final summary of all our selected options. Now all that's left is to remove the micro SD card. Insert it into our Raspberry Pi and decide what project we're going to build this time. Do you use Raspberry Pi? What do you use it for? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching.